Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Big Geekers TV. This is a bit of a weird one today because <laughs> we've got my brother on the channel because my dad's my dad's um sick in bed at the moment. If um that's why we're not going to be like screaming too loud today because he's in the room next door. No, so. <laughs> we don't want to be too loud, so. Tom, I'm Tom. Hi. Um, he's my brother. He's the really good Arsenal fan because he watches every single Arsenal game. Like me and my dad, don't you? Yes, like, but most games I'm kind of been disappointing in, but at least they haven't lost in the last. I'm not talking about Arsenal. I'm talking about how bad of a fan you are. <laughs> All right, let's um, let's um stop talking about him. Let's talk about Arsenal. So in the last game. We beat um, Newcastle 4-0, very convincing second half. Not so good first half, but second half we were brilliant. So, have you got any more thoughts on that game, Tom? Yeah, well, the first the first half of the game, like, um, Newcastle were in it a lot. Same as Arsenal, they were kind of, like, squared up. But second half, Arsenal just took over them and got the goals. Yeah, um, what do you think about how Pepe's been playing in... Do well, you think he's living up to a seventy-two million pound well, wage mark? At the fir- start of the season, definitely not because he we just didn't see his good side. But like when he when we moved on to the season, like at least by in seven, twenty in twenty twenty, we've been yeah, twenty twenty. He's well. been great, brilliant, like one man matches of nearly most games, and yeah, he's just been good at skilling, running. Took great goals, few goals. They've been pretty decent. You know what? You you've got some good knowledge, mate. You've actually. If if Dad never wanted to do this your job anymore, you would actually be a good replacement. We could have the three of us. That'll be. No, we don't have three microphones. Well. We'll get some. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're buying it. Um. So, let's all, let's just get on to the game. Let's we've we've been talking waffles the whole time so <laughs> let's get into the game so we're hosting Olympiacos tomorrow morning 6 a.m for us actually i think it's a bit earlier than that yeah, it's, it's a bit earlier than that um it would be late for you guys it's in greece so it's i don't think there's going to be many arsenal fans traveling it's not going to be obviously it's not at home so yeah but hopefully you guys who are traveling to the game is going to be good fans and Making as much noise as the um the Greece fans, cause yeah, cause you know like Olympiacos isn't like the most favorite team. Arsenal like more famous. There'll be more supporters from Arsenal than Olympiacos. So never know. There could be more Arsenal fans coming in to watch the great Europa League. No, that's not true. Is it not I, Europa League? It is Europa League, but only a little part of the stadium gets. The away fans, so Arsenal the away fans. Yeah, but I I still think that part of the away fan seats, I think they're going to be full. Yeah, all right. Completely full. So let's get into Olympiacos' form. They actually won 4-0 um, on Sunday as well, and they beat Panionios. I've got no idea how to say that team. Sorry, I'm sure you guys are a great team, but... They won 4-0. They, they also won 3-2 the game before that, and... One nil. So they've been playing really good lately. Um, they're also first on the um Greek Super League ladder. So they've been in great form. So they might be bound um in coming into this game with a bundle yeah. of confidence. So that's good for them. But let's get on to us. We've we've been Wait. we've been pretty good haven't in twenty twenty. We haven't lost, one, haven't we? No. Um, but we've had most of our games have been draws and yeah. But at least. Not a, it's not a lose. It's not a loss, but um, we we're bouncing up on the table. We went from twelfth to tenth. How good is that? Two positions up. Yeah, I know. <laughs> but so now good. we're now we're tenth on the ladder. So. Oh, I think I think we weren't just twelfth. We were less than that. I think. We were we we were thirteenth at some stage, but yeah. let's not talk about the Premier League. Let's talk about the Europa League. We won the group stage of the Europa League. We did pretty good in that. Um. But now it's on to the next round of the Europa League. Let's let's actually Please try and me. let's try and use this as a way of getting back into the Champions League and yes. keep going forward in the Europa League to win the Europa League. But it's early days now. We've got to 
doing heaps of um stages of Europa League. Yeah, first, and so. um that Man City got banned just in the five five places um in teams on the ladder of Premier League. If we come fifth, good chance for us. Yeah, so but but this is just another way of getting back in Champions League. So, um, do you want to get into the predicted lineups? Yes, yeah, sure. So, so, goal, I would say Martinez. Yeah, Martinez. He's been he's been pretty decent when he's been asked yes. to play. Who are you gonna put on the left back? I would say for the left. I'm, I'm gonna, gonna play Kolasinac. Kolasinac. Yeah. He's he's been back from injury. Maybe give Saka a bit of a well, rest because yeah, Saka's nice been playing thing, no. way too much lately. But Klasnac is back from injury. He might just need a just a Europa League game to get back to fitness, and then he'll mm. should be ready to play Premier League. But I think Saka's just too good for him at the moment. <laughs> Saka's, Saka's too good for everyone. Down everything. But we're gonna play Saka on the left, centre back. I'm gonna start Pablo Mari. I'm gonna give him his debut game for Arsenal. Yep, he did play in the under twenty threes the other day, but he looked pretty good in that. So. He looks like he's fit, kind of ready to come back into, maybe not Premier League just yet. He just needs to adapt, adapt a bit more. Maybe Europa League will be a good start for him. So yes. I'm gonna play, I'm gonna play him. Then I'm gonna play. Say Mustafi or um. I'm gonna play Socrates. Oh, Socrates. Socrates yeah. hasn't played much lately, but. He's been, in. he's been he's been decent at the start of the season. He wasn't too good, but he's get, been playing a bit better under Arteta, especially. And next to Louise. Yeah, next to Louise, he's been pretty good. So I'm going to play Pablo Mari and Socrates there. Uh, also on the right. The right, I would say Cedric as his first game too. He's injured. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, how long? S- see, he, he keeps up to date with all the Arsenal <laughs> news, doesn't he? Oh. Um, uh, Just do Bellerin. 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 I'm not playing Bellerin. He just, I think he, too many games since he's been back. So I'm going to give him a break. Maitland Niles, Ainsley. I'm 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 gonna say Bellerin. All right. Well, that's your opinion. In the midfield, I'm gonna play Gwen Doozy, Even though I had no idea where he was the other day. Yes. I'm gonna play him, and I'm also gonna play Terrera and give Granite Jacker a little break. Yeah, attacking sure. midfield. Mhm. Attacking I, midfield. I have a feeling Özil. Oh, actually, that no, Özil and Terrera aren't coming to Greece to play. That said in an article, so. Are they not both of them? No, no. Oh, that's. So Jacko, I don't know about that. So you're gonna play Jacko and. I'll play Jacko and Gunduzi, and then I'll play Willick. Joe Willick. Yeah, that's actually a good start. I haven't, he hasn't played too much lately, so he might play pretty good in this game. On the left wing, I'm gonna play um, what's his name? Martinelli. Martinelli. Oh, that's what I was talking about. You read my mind. Mm. He's he's been so good. exceptional this season. Up front, I'm going to play Eddie Nketiah. He didn't have the best game, I he, thought, the he, other day. Even though he came to the club, well, he came to the club a few years ago, but that he came back from loan, I think he needs to get a few games. For yeah, he team. needs a few games to adapt back from Leeds United in the championship. So yes. he's the man I'm going to play up front on, on the right wing. Right. Oh, I'm not sure about this. I'm just going to say... I'm gonna play Pepe. We need an ex- we need a player. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna take Eddie Nketiah off. I'm gonna play Lacazette. After that goal, I think Lacazette he's gonna bounce back. Yeah. He's gonna be bouncing he back, to wanting his... to wanting to keep playing really well, like he mm. did at the end of that game. And that goal is gonna give him hell of a lot of confidence. But on the right, I'm gonna play Reece Nelson. Actually, I know uh-huh. he. He came back from a little bit of an injury scare, but he's he lo- it looks like he's back in he's back um back in the team because he was on the bench the other day in uh, the other day so looks like he should be back so I'm gonna play him on the right so let's wrap it up um Martinez um Ma- so we'll play Martinez in goals left back who do we say again um Kolasinac, Kolasinac defense center back Socrates and Pablo Mari right back right Matt back. or no um, not Bellerin or Bellerin um holding midfielders I'm going to play Gwen Doozy if, and Granite Jackal if I read it wrong which I thought I didn't <laughs> I, I would have thought Torreira would have played in Ozil or Sebaos but I would have thought that Gwen Doozy Jacko and 
Um, yeah. Um, what are you talking about? I don't know. But above that, we're going to play Willock, left wing, Martinelli, yeah, up front. Yeah, Willock. Up front, Lacazette, and right wing. Pepe. Re- I said Reese well, Nelson. Pe- yeah. Reese Nelson I, or Pepe? We I don't know. I would have thought Pepe would be on the bench because usually in the Europa League, he is on the bench and then he comes on as a super sub. As like that free ki- double free kick. Double free kick, yeah. Brilliant. But let's not let's not drag it on too long because we don't want to wake our dad up, don't we? Um, <laughs> let's wrap it. Let, let's wrap it up there. Hopefully you enjoyed um this kid being on the on the channel. Um, if you want to check my channel out, it's called Tommy T. <laughs> Just search that up. No, you there. can't plug yourself in our channel because we don't really have many views anyway. Lately. Uh, you Charlie you guys need to pick up you guys need to pick up your stuff. You haven't been watching this channel lately, so don't get too stressed. Um, it's okay, but yeah, we have great content of Arsenal, so please check it out and and leave it in the comments if you want this this fan to keep staying in the channel or would you rather my dad? So personally, I'm sorry, mate. I'd rather dad. <laughs> Guys, I know you. We're, we'll fight me, behind the ca- we'll fight when we stop behind the camera. So, I think I thanks know. thanks for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, you. watch our Instagram account, which will be in the link in the description. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Come on, Arsenal. Let's beat Olympiacos. Let's go. It's we away. Can get this. Let's get some away goals. Come on, Arsenal. Let's, Let's go. go. Bye.